hello and welcome to my channel once again today i shall show you how to analyze your xrd data using the math software i think you have probably heard about this new software match for analyzing the xrd patterns i have got the match software trial version and i shall use this one you can see this is trial version and i shall use this software or export something to analyze my xrd data so let's start first of all let me open an ascii file i have kept here it this is the xrd data of the tio2 nanotubes grown on the titanium substrate so let's open it and you can see lots of options here for x-rays for neutron however i am only interested with the x-rays and uh, i have used copper k alpha x-ray source and this is the wavelength 1.54 1 fine 2 theta is checked in you can also check in dispersing in angstrom however mm, i am interested with 2 theta right now so okay here comes the xrd pattern you can see but uh, you can see that uh, the background is not good at all uh, so i want to do some subtraction so let subtract the background you can see the option subtract background just click it and you can see pretty good xrd pattern now my task is to find the xrd peaks for tio2 which i expect will be anatase and there will be some peaks for titanium as well coming from the substrate underneath so you can see the periodic table is here lots of options element selection uh, by mouse all none any optional and you can do tuzzle reset options and name of the element element count formula sum everything is there and if you um, have no organic compound in your sample then you may also check in this box it will consider only inorganic samples and reduce the options so let's uh, try with first of all tio2 okay so tuzzle titanium and oxygen is there so two is automatically selected there you can see lots of data uh, have come here appeared here you can select from it also but uh, i shall uh, select more precisely from here and formula you can see these um, different types of titanium oxide based structures are there but i am going to choose tio2 okay and see this entry has come here you have to just drag it over here and drop it fine now you can see these are the um, peaks uh, from the database and these are matching quite well with my pattern so my next task is to tell math software to run phase identification so click it and it will work yeah it is working now let's see what has happened this is data sheet you have to select it and data sheet and you have you can see these things these are the hkl values dispersing as well intensity and let's see the printable data sheet yes 
this is the report ARA for this time is representing the titanium oxide in anatase phase and it has um, given space group uh, peak matched peaks in range everything there calculated density in the crystal system unit cell parameters everything there and you can see these are the matched uh, values or matched uh, planes so everyone knows uh, the 101 and that is 101 pl plane is the most prominent plane in TIO to anatase and um, we also have got the maximum intensity here for the anatase 101 plane and other planes are there as well so you can see it now I'm quitting this uh, my next task will be to find the Mm, database for titanium so let's reset it reset everything Tazel, titanium now you can see lots of mm, entries on titanium has come you can also select from here two is there no uh, let me choose it from here titanium let's see titanium beta drag and drop oh look uh, the formula matching is uh, 0 0.8067 this is the highest formula matching so I should select these actually so I am deleting it just right click on it and delete from match list and it will get deleted then I shall choose this one you can see let's drag and drop it fine now again let me tell match to run phase identification it has indeed so it's the data sheet for titanium right now you can see and let me check the report now uh, A is representing titanium oxide anatase phase and B is representing titanium so let's see this A will represent anatase phase of titanium on dioxide and B will represent the XRD uh, patterns of titanium so you can see that you are getting anatase phase of titanium dioxide as well as few um, peaks from titanium and it is quite expected for our sample as titanium is at the bottom of the uh, titanium dioxide nanotubes because titanium is our substrate you can see everything is there and uh, you can save it as well save it ok I am saving as PDF my desktop save it and let's see what has happened so you can see the report and uh, this is the PNG file of the image you can see it and if you are using LaTeX and you can also use this PNG file uh, and if you are writing your paper using word then it is also fine let's see the pdf version oh what has happened something has gone wrong yeah you can see the 
comprehensive data sheet analysis report is here formula sum a will represent tio2 this is 78.6 percent and titanium is 21.4 percent of the data and uh, entries are there also and this formula matching the higher will be the value the more will be the formula matching and your result will be better so you can automatically getting uh, you can automatically get the uh, fwhm values as well we are not to calculate it separately you are getting that 2 theta displacing is there and matched which peaks you are getting which is being automatically generated here is the plot but one thing I can find here the HKL values you cannot see the HKL values corresponding HKL values so you have to write them differently you have to write them separately I guess maybe there are some option but I don't know I can find that here is the complete data sheet so it's pretty interesting I guess using match software you can download it and I guess uh, you will get 60 days trial version I am also using the trial version and I am using it for first time that's it from me for now if you like this video you can also download the mesh software and use and if you like it if you feel comfortable in working it you may purchase the software as well thank you for your time and watching my video thank you